So much for staying with us here at 430. I'm Christian Casadas. And I'm Kirsten Joyce. All right, remember the grasshopper invasion oh, that was yeah. back in 2019? Well, if you didn't live here back then, well, it was a grasshopper invasion here in Las Vegas at the end of, Ju of July, taking over the strip, and now it's a big concern again. Yeah, many of you have reached out to us saying, you're seeing a lot of these guys. Could we have another infestation? Mary Jane Beleza found the answer, as well as some other insects that might be bugging you this time of year. With the recent sightings of grasshoppers and crickets around the valley, 8 News Now viewers are wondering what to expect the next few months. They were just chirping and chirping and chirping at a very, very shrill, shrill, shrill level. Trish Nash spent hours trying to figure out where the noise was coming from in her Henderson home before discovering a group of crickets and grasshoppers made their way into her vent, garage, and laundry room. I contacted a pest control company and ask them, you know, what their thoughts were about this. And they just explain that it's really nothing that they can, you, you can't really um, control them as uh, with a service because they're just going to continue to come. Sightings aren't just limited to Henderson. Eight News Now viewers report seeing these insects in Summerlin, Mountain's Edge, Centennial Hills, North Las Vegas, the Thomas and Mack parking lot at UNLV, and even right here in the Channel 8 parking lot. Could Las Vegas see another grasshopper infestation? I have seen so many out here. Field biologist Maria Minich says it's possible. I think 2019 was a different year because it was, it was a lot drier. than it. We had more monsoon this year, more rains. Um, so I don't honestly believe that it's going to be that bad, but it could get worse. Minich says readily available food sources grasshoppers feed on, like other smaller insects and plants, are keeping them thriving, along with the change in climate conditions. She says don't be surprised if you continue to see grasshoppers stick around. We had a pretty hot, dry, dry summer. We did have some monsoon, definitely, but that, those combined, those factors combined, are just allowing this explosion of the population. These insects are harmless. If you come across them, it's best to leave them alone. Mary Jane Belieza, 8 News Now. Well, grasshoppers move around. They fly to find food, so you might see them traveling alone or in large groups.